Hey guys, if you like this video, please hit the subscribe button. Also press the bell icon to get notification of our send uploads. Thank you. Hey guys, what is going on? This is Tumbi Fox. So guys, uh, in this video, I will show you how you can update your J7 Prime 2 to Android Pie at Red 9. So guys, that's really easy. So if you want to update your device, then uh, you have to watch this video from the beginning to the uh, end. So let's get started. So first of all, you have to download the firmware. So if you want to download the firmware, you have to uh, click on this first link, uh, the, all the links are in the description. So let me show you how to uh, verify this. So click on the first link in the, from the description box and then you select your browser. So here you can see uh, this link, uh, it will redirect you to this page. So here you have to do one thing is uh, click on this subscribe button. So click on the subscribe button and it will bring you to this page here you have to click on this uh, subscribe button after clicking on this uh, press back button and go to the page here you can see uh, one verification is completed and again click on this like button and then click on this like button and it will redirect you to this page so here you have to like the video so let's wait so here you have to click on this like button so like it uh, don't miss uh, this because if you miss this uh, the verification will be uncompleted and you have to do this again so um, don't miss this so press back again so here you can see uh, verification completed now click on get link click on get link and uh, here you can see link unlocked so link has been unlocked now click on download so click on download and wait 5 seconds here so after waiting 5 seconds here you can see a uh, skip button here you can see the skip button click on it so uh, here you can see the uh, firmwares are here uh, you can select your country from here from Africa or if you're from Africa uh, or Asia you can select so I'm selecting India now you have to uh, download the first version so here you can see so that's the latest version click on it and you have to download it so the total file is about 1.98 GB so you have to download the slow speed mode because um, if you will click on this unlimited speed you have to register so i will not uh, recommend you to i will recommend you to uh, click on slow speed just click on it and download it click on it so guys here you can see uh, it has already started downloading so here you can see it has started downloading so uh, after uh, downloading this uh, you have to uh, download um, the tools and drivers so how to download you have to download uh, click on uh, the second link link will be in the description you have to open it with your browser so i'm opening uh, it like this so here you have to uh, download audio tool and uh, drivers so let's download uh, do not uh, download firmware from here because uh, that's not the original room so that's from third party website that's uh, not an original room so I have given you the original link the official website of Samsung firmware update and so self-free so do not uh, download firmware from here so you have to uh, uh, download uh, the audience software 
so here you can see download Audin software and download Samsung drivers so click on download Audin software so scroll down here you have to download um, here you have to download um, this option and this version so here you have to download because uh, after Android 6.0 uh, Marshmallow is Audin version 3.11.1 or higher. So click on download and click on download and download all the files. So select your uh, Gmail and then click on download. So here you can see uh, start downloading Audin 3. Try to download the latest one. So uh, you have to move all these files to your computer. If you have a computer, then you can flash it. So after downloading this, uh, uh, you have to download the Samsung USB driver. Click on it. Scroll down. Scroll down, and you have to download the latest Samsung firmware. So I'm downloading one. Uh, select your email address and uh, please uh, download it from Google Drive. So here you can see uh, firmware uh, USB driver downloading. So uh, I'm skipping. So after downloading the firmware and all these tools, uh, you have to install it. You have to move it to your computer. Uh, after moving, you have to unzip and install Audin, um, Audin software and install the drivers to your computer after that you have to flash it so I'm not going to show you how to flash it uh, in this video so if you want to know how to flash this firmware please check the description there will be found on the video how to flash it uh, please check the video there will be found how to flash it so guys, uh, hope you like this video. Uh, so if you like this video, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and also press the bell icon. So thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe.